In this video, we will talk about the spaces of the hand anatomy. We will talk about the four important spaces in the hand. Introduction. The hand contains several anatomical spaces that are important for the passage of tendons, nerves, and blood vessels. What are key anatomical spaces of the hand? The main spaces in the hand include the veiner space, the mid palmar space, the pulp space of the fingers, the forearm space of perona. Each space has distinct boundaries and contents that are critical for hand function. Number 1. Veiner Space Location It is located deep to the veiner muscles, lateral to the adductor pollicis muscle. Boundaries Proximal It begins from the distal end of flexor retinaculum, distal. It ends at the proximal transverse palmar crease. Contents It contains the flexor pollicis longus tendon and the branches of the median nerve, the mid-palmar space, location. It is located beneath the central part of the, palmar aponeurosis, boundaries, proximal. It begins at the forearm space of perona, distal. It ends at the facile sheaths of, third and fourth lumbricals, contents. It contains the flexor tendons of the fingers, flexor digitorum superficialis, and flexor digitorum profundus, lumbrical muscles, and the branches of the ulnar nerve, the pulp space of the fingers, location. It is found on the tips of fingers and thumb, structure. It consists of subcutaneous fat, that is fixed, and arranged in tiny compartments by fibrous septa, passing down from skin to periosteum of terminal phalanx. Infection of pulp space. Infection of this space is known as, willow. It occludes the blood vessels of the terminal phalanx, leading to necrosis of phalanx. It is relieved by making a lateral incision, to open the pulp space and save the phalanx. The last important space is, the forearm space of perona. It is above the wrist, but since it related to mid-palmar space, we will discuss it here. Location. It is a rectangular space, found in the lower part of the forearm, just above the wrist. Boundaries. Proximal. It begins at the origin of, flexor digitorum superficialis, distal. It ends at the, flexor retinaculum, and then, it communicates with mid-palmar space, 